Hi, this is Thundi from borderwork.com and welcome to our underground testing lab, aka my laundry room. Anyway, today we'll be testing out the Samsung Rugby Smart. Now, basically this whole review is all about seeing how well this phone survives in dirt, cold, heat, um, resistance, all that fun stuff. So, quick look at the device again. Now, the Rugby Smart, uh, I can see one key thing to note, it's got that screw behind that lets you lock the battery in place properly. It's all basically covered, all ports are sealed. You do have your 3.5 mm jack port there sealed in front. And of course your micro your mini USB port there sealed in the back. It's got physical buttons. You see the device here. It's got a super AMOLED display. It's got a 5 megapixel camera records at 720p here. Um, it's 4G on AT&T but HSP Plus. Running the latest version of TouchWiz on there. So you do have TouchWiz 4.0 on there on the device. Um, memory wise, I can't remember, but let's just take a quick look to see how much storage we have here again. So it comes with a 2 gig card, and you can expand it, of course, with 32. So enough of all that talking. So I have my laundry machine here. I'm just going to bring this down a little bit so you guys can see. And what we're going to do is going to throw this in the laundry machine, um, in the dryer. We're going to throw this in the dryer. So basically, we're going to do a heat test as well as resistance. It's going to tumble in there for about five minutes. If it survives, it survives. If it doesn't, then I guess so. And then we'll move on to the next test. So that's the dryer. Give you guys a better look. There it is. Rugby Smart. Phone's on, phone's working. Put it in there. It's gonna sound really loud. Let's put it in there for a few minutes. Bring your press, high. So that's it. Come back in five minutes, check it out. We'll probably speed through the video in this point, all right? Five minutes to check it out. Okie dokie. It's kind of hot in here. All right. It's bounced around. It's still on. It's a little hot though. Actually, you can feel the heat coming from the device. Uh, the back cover feels a little loose, but it's intact. You can see that there. But anyway, phone works. Still fine. You can go browse the web there. One of our wallpapers. Yeah, so heat test. It's warm. Still works. Try the camera out. See if the camera actually does take some pictures. So we'll take a picture here. All right, do that. So now let's head outside, uh, test it out with some dust. All right, so we're outside with the um, Rugby Smart. Let's see how it fares with dust, dirt, and if I just chuck it. And then we know this resistance is pretty good. Um, of course, it's got Gorilla Glass, so of course that helps out. But um, of course, this is landed in grass. And um, it's dirt template, if you will. Uh, you can see if I decide to chuck it anywhere around here, except of course on the pavement, and I'll show you why you shouldn't do that quickly. Chucked it, it bounced off the pavement. That's what happened. You guys can see that clearly. But it, it still still works. Tossed it over there. Uh, let's see how well this fares. Again, it's you know it's, it's waterproof, it's dirt proof, you know, all that fun stuff. You know, you can see the sand, chuck it there. I drop it, you know, really doesn't matter, that kind of thing. So, again, the phone still works, no issues, and it's great. And, um, you know, it's, 
you know, if you're an outdoor type kind of guy, gal, this is kind of fun for you. You can see I've been chucking it up in the air and uh, still works. Like I said, if you are doing this on pavements, grass, that kind of stuff, you're going to have some issues with it. So that's pretty much it. And we'll head back inside. We'll do the water test. And we'll also do a 720B recording, I think, on the water. See if it works and see how well that pans out. As you can see, it's been out here for a minute. It's water, ice, and the phone still works. So let's move on to our next test. So we've put our Rugby Smart in a dryer, we've put it out in the cold, we've tossed it around outside. Now let's just do some water submersion tests. Now this is not one meter, but we're going to put it in here for about 10 minutes and we're also going to be recording at the same time uh, with the uh, camera on the phone. It records at 720p. And go in here, check out the settings, just see what we have. Resolution. Seven twenty P, so let's go ahead, hit record. It's recording there. Submerge it. And I'm going to leave it there for about 10 minutes. We'll get back to you guys. We'll probably time lapse this video, but uh, check it out. underwater sound recording hopefully you can hear that this is a 720p camera test on the water so if this picks up the sound that's pretty good that's all I have to say for now and um, yeah Alright, let's grab that out. So, you can see it still works. Just a little wet, so I have to clean that off for a second. The uh, Rugby Smart still works, functions. You can see, slide through uh, pretty good. Again, this is a 4G device, so of course we can quickly do a speed test here. But this is not an LT device, this is a HSPA Plus device. So, you know, of course we can do a speed test, we can do a speed test on the water. Uh, you can see. 3.5. I don't know why that is doing that, but hey. So you can see that there. Um, Overall, I like it. Um, we've put it through the ringer. Uh, we threw it in the dryer for some heat as well as resistance. We tossed it around outside. 
get, did get some damage. We mentioned that, and yeah, but that was a, a nice big drop on uh, pavement, but it still works well. Um, you can see it works well on the water. We put it outside in the snow while it was raining. So, so far, so good. No issues at all. And, you know, it's got a Super AMOLED Plus display. Uh, Super AMOLED Plus display. It's got a front-facing camera, 5 megapixel of camera, records at 720, and physical buttons. And this bad boy is sturdy. So, um, uh, pretty much, I think this is a solid choice. You know, I think if you're looking for a smartphone, this is something you should look for. So, if you guys have any questions or any comments, uh, let us know. Don't forget to subscribe to all our pages on Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, uh, as well as our new YouTube channel, Board Fam. Um, we have this, the links for you. You can hit the two buttons there to subscribe. And uh, like I said, this is a very cool phone for someone's outdoors, who's an outdoorsy type. Uh, it gives you a lot of modern features, dual core processing and all that. Plus, if you're someone who you know you're clumsy and you drop your device all the time and you leave it in your jeans and you throw it in the washer and dryer, <laughs> This will survive that. So, um, this is <coughs> excuse me. This is Thunder. saying thank you, and uh, always enjoy entertainment.